Hi, I'm Tim. Welcome and thanks for logging on. If you love this watch, email me, tmasso at thewatchbox.com. It's in the description below. Your purchase and pricing email question line for buying this or any watch you see on any Watchbox platform. Please reach out to me directly, email tmasso at thewatchbox.com for pricing details. Today, we we're discussing a watch that bowed back in 1999 and it was a landmark piece. It took the 1994 Ulysse Norden San Marcos GMT plus minus system for travel time and combined it with the 1996 Perpetual Ludwig bidirectional perpetual calendar. So in 99, the Ulysse Norden GMT plus minus perpetual was born and in a wonderfully conventional case design and a wearable size. While this watch often becomes unwieldy both in size and shape in the modern era, the original one was very much a product of the tastes in the late 90s. So though this is white gold, and thus weighty, it's only 38.5 millimeters in diameter. It's 12.8 millimeters thick from lug tip to lug tip, wonderfully compact at 45.1 millimeters. It has a 20 millimeter spacing between the lugs, and this one includes a full matching white gold bracelet and clasp. On my 16 centimeter circumference wrist, it wears beautifully. The lugs are nowhere near the edge of my wrist, and you can really see that to advantage down the barrel, though it's also evident from over the top. The watch is flat with a domed bezel. It slides easily underneath the cuff. No, it is a dress watch. It's a sporty looking dress watch that you can wear all the time. We'll talk more about that in a moment. It has a significant weight to it. So tasteful style and compact dimensions don't mean it lacks a sense of luxury. The bracelet is a fascinating piece, uh, similar to one commonly fitted on UN sports watches in the era. You can see it has a couple of different focal planes with channels or gullies in between the links. The links are all of high polish and you can see in profile, they're also very dissimilar in shape. We have the UN anchor reminding you that Ulysse Norden, past and present, famous for its marine chronometers or navigation clocks. Here we have a couple of removable links and you can see that they are fixed in place by screws and quite a few of them. We have them on both sides, including an intermediate sized link for you to fine tune the fit. We have a white gold clasp that is friction fit and double deployant. So it's held together by a snapshot friction fit closure. And then we have two anchors facing each other. This watch has been polished in its time, though you can see the bevels, or I should say the fluting on the lugs, they remain deep and well-defined, so this is a well-preserved watch. You can also see that it has a handsome and enduring profile. Being a conventional round watch, it doesn't have to contend with some of the controversial design elements, most of them intended for the Russian market that came to define Ulysse Norden in the 2000s. We have this wonderful, lacquered insert with the UN logo and the anchor, and then we have the plus minus pushers. These make travel time easy to endure as you can operate them forward or backwards without disturbing the minute or the 24 hour second time zone. You can also see that the local time drives drives the oversized date or the grand dot, the double digit date, drives it backwards or forwards with a remarkable snappiness. And not only can you drive the date forward and backwards using the travel time function, this is a genuine and rare bi-directional perpetual calendar, Ludwig Oxlund's masterpiece. He spent time restoring clocks for the Vatican, many of which were designed to calculate the vernal equinox and the start of Easter. And he learned volumes about how to create sophisticated calendar systems that were also user-friendly and compact, and he deployed that knowledge at Ulysse Norden. So we can adjust the calendar forward and backwards, which means this watch will not have to go back to the manufacturer in the year 2100, when most other perpetual calendars will. We'll do a loom shot here so you can get a sense of the watch. It is loomed, and that does include the second time zone, which is in a 24-hour format, so it's quite handy for a dress watch. They're usually not this well loomed. We have that secondary scale. When you pull the crown out all the way, you adjust everything in sync. That's how you adjust the 24-hour second time zone. The dial has several different focal planes, starting with the flange outboard that includes the second time zone. The center dial has a silver metallic sunburst, rhodium plated and applied indices and Roman numerals. We have the applique anchor. We have blued leaf style hands for the hours, minutes, and seconds. We have an aperture style calendar that even includes the year and the decade, which is a lot of fun to show to your friends. Plus, it's very intuitive to read. It is right here, Monday, October 8th, 
of 2022. And the nice thing is, unlike other perpetual calendar systems that force you to use some sort of an awkward tool, this doesn't test your talents with a pusher tool, nor does it force you to press a trigger 400 times or whatever stupid number in order to correct your calendar. Everything can be done and quickly through the crown. Turning it all over, you can see the UN Caliber 32 automatic, which is distantly Lemania based. It's also quite attractive, and compared to later applications and larger cases, it fills this case well. You can see that the rotor is in white gold and features a combination of beveling, satination, and also a sort of roughed pattern within its recesses, plus the lacquered UN logo. It winds automatically using a Paul based magic lever system that's visible through the skeletonized bridge for the winding system. 48 hour power reserve, 4 hertz beat rate. And of course, it is also a perpetual calendar. All of this pivoting on 34 joules and quite nicely decorated. Water resistance is 30 meters. So while it is a sporty dress watch, it is still a dress watch. You don't want to take this watch swimming. Reach out to Tmaso at thewatchbox.com for purchase and pricing details of the landmark Ulysse Norden GMT plus minus perpetual.